Looks like they're having a big sale in there. It says occult books. The future is never written. It looks pretty ratty. And I do mean ratty. No way I'm not getting any closer to that. Don't touch the books unless you know what you want. No way I'm touching that. This head seems almost alive. I think I saw it move. It's a bottle of eye drops. It's a package of tea. Creepy. Welcome to the Thimbleweed Park Occult Bookstore, Dolores. The bubble fish has a banana. It's good to see you again, Marina. Dolores, you little mojo bean. I'm so pleased to see you back in town. If anyone has given you any trouble in the big city, you say the word and I'll put a hex on them. I've got a really good one I'm dying to use that will turn their bathing suit parts green. What is it with you and those totally trippin' hexes? I like to get creative with my craft, dear. On an unrelated note, do you know anyone who deserves a permanent talking zit on their face? Oh, Marina, enough with the curses already, jeez. Although, if my sister keeps acting like a total bin bet, I might come back to you. I guess you heard about my uncle? Ah, oh, yes, dear, and I'm sorry for your loss. Are you, though? If you are sad, then I am sad for you, Dolores. Although I can't pretend that the idea of Chuck roasting in the fires of hell doesn't provide me with some amusement. That's like way harsh, Marina. But to be perfectly honest, I don't really know how to feel right now. People really loved my uncle, didn't they? It was a mixed bag, my dear. Most of the town adored Chuck, but there were many of us who despised the man and sense the darkness within. What did you mean by the darkness my uncle had? Chuck exuded an aura of greatness, but that greatness was always balanced on a knife's edge of good and evil. The man was ruthless and fell into the dark a long time ago. I thought he wanted me to be happy, but really, he just wanted me to keep his legacy alive. I idolized my uncle, but if that's all I was to him, then I wonder if I ever really knew the man at all. How have things been since I left? Oh, same old, same old. Leonard ate all the donuts at the Quickie Pal, Ransom is still a jerk, cryptozoologists are hunting the tentacle monsters, the usual. Well, you're the one with the exciting new life as a game developer. Tell me all about it. Do you really want to hear about my job? Yes, absolutely. Okay, but you gotta keep this under your scarf. We're gonna be bringing out these radical new text adventure games, but plot twist, they're gonna have pictures instead of text. We're calling them clickers because you have to click on the picture instead of just typing. Totally fresh, right? That sounds very nice, dear. But I already read about that on one of those CompuServe chat rooms. You were on a CompuServe chat room? Get a clue, dear. It's 1987. There's a whole new world of online hexing opening up, and there's no way I'm gonna miss out. That and the internet is great for monitoring my stock portfolio. I had no idea Voodoo was so high-tech these days. Goodbye, Madame Marina. Come back anytime, Dolores. It's on cursed wheels. That's as far to the right as it moves. I'll have to pull it to move it to the left.
It's a book with a skull on the cover. Ha, huh, not just any book with a skull on the cover. It's the Book of the Dead. Take it if you wish. It's on the house. But beware! Beware of what? Huh, nothing. It just sounded ominous. Don't touch the books unless you know what you want. Don't touch the books unless you know what you want. Pizza coupons! Well, back to work, Abu. Who's that now? This is unbelievable. An alive human in my penthouse. Cleta's in so much trouble next time I see her. Looks fine to me. It looks like a book can be placed here. The book is glowing! Last week on Hospital Hygiene... The elevator isn't on this floor. It's a button to call the elevator. Mumbo Jumbo. Mumbonius Jumbonius. Let me visit my dead relatives. Looks like Chuck got a tomb to fit his ego. Where's my sarcophagus? Why does Brother Chuck get one and I don't? Maybe it's because no one found my body. Where's my sarcophagus? Why did it's a big electrical knife switch straight out of Frankenstein? 